So, a couple of days ago, Safari Limited just released um, the um, the Dino Dan toy figures. Believe it or not, some of them are cool and some of them, you know, aren't, in my opinion. I do like the Alberta Source figure. I think it's very cool. It's a good thing that Safari Limited brought, bring back Alberta Source because it's actually my favorite. Well, other than besides Tyrannosaurus Rex, Alberta Source is my second favorite Tyrannosaurid and Tyrannosaur in general. And the Ankylosaur figure, although it's cool looking, I'm not really impressed with the green texture, but that's just me though. I don't know. They could have done other things better. Um, and then, of course, the quote-unquote Nano Tyrannus, or in this case, Juvenile Tyrannosaurus Rex. Yeah, I love the, the Juvenile Tyrannosaurus Rex figure, but they need to stop calling it Nano Tyrannus because it's kind of been debunked at this point, really, that Nano Tyrannus is in a valid genus. <laughs> Because we now know that the growth stages of Tyrannosaurus Rex. It was a fast, agile predator as a juvenile, and then it became a robust, powerful adult animal. So, I don't know why they call it Nano Tyrannus still. Not to mention, it's not just Safari Limited, PNSO, they also have a Nano Tyrannus. Uh, figure but it technically it's a juvenile tyrannosaurus rex but anyways i still hope to see more of the 2022 um safari limited toys i hope i can get some maybe i'll review some of them and yeah but as for the dino dan series no. Because at the end of the day, it's just a children's movie, and who wants to watch a children's movie? I'm just a grown-ass adult, but that's just me, though. So, yeah.